Marshall, I guess a, a dream day really for, for Gloucestershire given the, the starting point and, and right back with you at the crease and getting not only to that 350 mark but the 400 as well I guess must have been a, a massive boost. Yeah, I think, um, no, perfectly summed up. Um, I was, you know, after a chat as well, it was really nice to just um, set the day up obviously with the bat. Uh, trying to, like you say, get the first hurdle, which was 350, um, and then to 400. So I thought um, Joshua batted really well. So um, <clears throat> I just try and do my job um, at the end with the bat. Um, hopefully try and entertain a little bit now and then. And then, uh, yeah, when it came to to the start and the bowling things of of, of that side of, of things and the real my real job. Um, Obviously, we tried to assess what, what was happening when we were batting, uh, feeding off the batters and just finding a little bit of info. Obviously, I got off a bit of a flyer and uh, we just tried to go back to the, the good old norm and try and squeeze a couple of dots in um, and the rebuild from there. And then um, the game will reward you if, you if you try and string a couple of dots together. So, yeah, it's fairly nice. It was fairly nice to, to then... Um, Get, get the ball rolling. So, uh, yeah, it was quite a nice day. Yeah, and particularly the ball rolling with that <laughs> two wickets and two balls in the first over after lunch to get players out of the quality of Vasconcelos and Karen Naya. I guess that's probably set up what was a, a, a terrific session for Gloucestershire in, in that middle part. I think, um, yeah, like, like a lot of times, that's, as a bowler, that's your goal, you know, trying to squeeze as, as quick as possible and be back on it. So um, I was fairly happy just by trying to execute what I was planning. Um, yeah, and then things just go, went my way, um, trying to build pressure from there. Um, it's always nice to, to see the boys happy in a sense, like trying to, to, to get the vibe back up, as we call it, or just trying to, to get um, positive feedback out, out in the field. Um, so it's always nice to get two in one over, and then obviously then you start rebuilding and, and the momentum started shifting uh, more into our way. Um, Still half a job done, so we'll wait and see. Has that day really shown what this Gloucestershire attack is about in terms of a lot of the time you had somebody bowling with extreme pace at one end and Zappa bowling beautifully at the other end? I, I guess it, it really shows you what, what that attack is and, and could be. I think, I think spot on. I think Zaff is, 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 is a superb bowler, as we all know. Um, and then obviously he, he kept it really dry on the other side, which helped us as a seamers group just to rotate from that side. So, you know, he bowled a lot of, I think, 10 overs and a, he picked up a, a, a crucial wicket in there. And then um, he obviously got rewarded again. But, um, you know, as in batting, building, building partnerships and bowling is, is so crucial as well. Um, so that, that's, it's really nice to feed off each other in that way. Um, so I thoroughly enjoyed that. And it, it just keeps the spirit up, you know, if the, if the game is not going anywhere, you know you're squeezing and you're asking the right questions. So, yeah, that was a goal. And in terms of your personal milestone, <laughs> a back-to-back -back games with five wicket hauls, I guess that must be really pleasing. To be fair, uh, personal milestone is one thing, uh, like I keep on reiterating, it's really nice to... to um, Get a couple of balls straight. <laughs> That's the goal. Um, no, it's nice to, to pick up a fiver and then build from there. Like I keep reiterating, I think, in my previous interview as well, it's, it's about trying to get all 20. So um, we haven't done it yet. Um, so that's the main goal um, going forward. And uh, yeah, I'm not thinking too far ahead. I'm just trying to take it session by session. And um, yeah, hopefully can, can mimic what happened in the first innings. And along those lines, session by session of course but is there a number in mind in terms of runs over something like that or is it just a case of seeing how it goes tomorrow in terms of what you might want to set Northamptonshire I think um, we had a, just a quick discussion I think at this stage it's just still playing just cricket and see how it um, unravels in the first hour um, you never know the game is, is a, it's a, cricket's an interesting game so um, I'm not going to predict any score out there or say what the total should be I think um like I keep reiterating, I think we'll take it session by session and then uh, play it, play it, play it from there. Well, best of luck, Marshall. Thank you.